guys, my name is Javon, and you're watching TNOC. Hello guys and gals, welcome to TNOC, I'm Javon and today I was going to have episode 2 of TNOC Rabbits, but the video came out all blurry, so I decided to do a voiceover thingy, hopefully we don't have this same mistake next episode. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to enter the giveaways, because I have big plans for this channel and I hope you're here to enjoy them. Okay, let's get to the video. On January 1st, 2022, starting small forward Riker Wolf was arrested for a DUI. On January 2nd, Carter White, our power forward, was suffering from an MCL sprain and was sidelined for the next 84 days. He was replaced by 28-year-old Jesus Malone, who the Rabbit signed a three-year contract paying him $13.17 million a year. Fast forward to January 23rd, same year, Brian Booker and our backup point guard decided to trash a hotel room and get mad at me for taking disciplinary actions. The very next day, small forward Lester Chang decided to get physical with one of our coaches. Okay, so on February 2nd, Jerry Scar, our shooting guard, decided on his off day not to stop and sign autographs for some fans. Not gonna lie, I didn't care about this situation, so I kinda skipped over it. March 18th, 2022, Neil Shelton did the same thing Jerry Scott did, and I'm officially ready to quit. March 22nd, Billy West, our backup center, also sprained his MCL and will be out for the next 81 days. Unfortunately, we did not make the playoffs. We finished ninth in our conference and third in our division. We finished third in three point percentage, 17th in points per game, 30 in in field goals percentage, which is dead last, and 23rd in free throw percentage. We finished 22nd in assists, 11th in rebounds, and 28th in blocks. We finished the season with 37 wins and 45 losses. On April 1st, my favorite player, Jerry Scott, two-piece the Rabbits head coach, Vincent Knight, and then proceeds to knock me unconscious for telling him not to do it again. I swear, there are a total of six nonsense situations while simming through the first rounds of the playoffs. They were so stupid, I didn't even feel like putting them in the notes. The rest of the playoffs went by quickly, and the world champions were, was the Nashville Bears with 70 wins and 12 losses. How you do that? Please, I really, I really need to know. And some good news on the year. Our very own Alberto Marquez started center first round draft pick at the age of 19 years old, won rookie of the year. We also upgraded our training court to level three, almost went bankrupt. That is all for today, but if you would like to be one of the players on, on our team, let me know what name you want and the position you want. And that is all, folks. See ya.